Hello guys, this is a short video of introduction to vitamins and minerals. Guys, don't panic as soon as you see this chapter because it's huge. It is actually very easy if you learn it in a proper way. Just write in the exam in this following manner and learn it with fun. Firstly, you need to know other names of each vitamins and chemistry along with its structure, metabolism, RDA, don't forget to put their units that is IU per day, biochemical functions and uses, deficiency manifestations and finally hypervitaminosis for vitamins and toxicity for minerals. Vitamins may be defined as organic compounds occurring in small quantities also known as micronutrient in different natural foods and necessary for growth and maintenance of good health in human beings. Main functions of vitamins are to maintain health, to prevent deficiency diseases, to help combat the aging processes, to regulate repair of body cells. Two main categories of vitamins are lipid soluble vitamins and water soluble vitamins. Lipid soluble vitamins are vitamin A, D, E and K. Water soluble vitamins are vitamin B, complexes and vitamin C. If you don't remember this, just remember there is a mnemonic for lipid soluble vitamins that is all dogs eat kittens A, D, E and K. Coming to its comparison, fat soluble vitamins are soluble in fat and absorbed along with lipids and they require bile salt for their absorption. During their absorption, they require carrier proteins that are stored in liver and not excreted. Water soluble vitamins are soluble in water, their absorption is simple and hence no carrier proteins are required. They are not stored and they are excreted as such. Deficiency manifests only when stores are depleted in lipid soluble vitamin and toxicity for lipid soluble vitamin or hypovitaminosis occurs whereas for water soluble vitamin unlikely because they are excreted as such. Treatment of deficiency in lipid soluble vitamin are single large doses may prevent deficiency whereas for water soluble vitamin regular dietary supply is required because they are not stored in body. Vitamin B complexes compiles a group of vitamins that is vitamin B1 also known as thymine, vitamin B2, riboflavin, B3, niacin, B5, pantothenic acid, B6, pyridoxine, B7, biotin, B9, folic acid and lastly B12, cobalamine. Important minerals are they are classified as major elements and minor elements. Major elements include calcium, magnesium, phosphorus, sodium, potassium, chloride and finally sulfur. Minor elements include iron, iodine, copper, magnesium, zinc, molybdenum, selenium and finally fluoride. This is the end of introduction. You will be updated with each vitamins and calcium, iron, copper and lead videos in upcoming days. Just enjoy the learning processes. Keep smiling. Thank you guys.